Uh, my name is Tom Forbes. I'm the president of Benchmark Environmental Engineering. Uh, Turnkey is our sister company. Benchmark and Turnkey operate under one roof, and so we jointly developed uh, the remedial approach for this site. Benchmark Turnkey, a leading environmental consultant based in the Northeast, was hired by the property owner to develop a remedial plan to address the contaminants, including PFAS, with target goals at or below the regulatory standards as part of New York's Brownfield Cleanup Program. So at this site here, we're injecting our plume stop liquid activated carbon product to cut off the migration of this PFAS plume and prevent any further migration of the plume, make sure that there's no receptors down gradient affected by this plume. We have a former refinery property here in Olean and, and we have problems related or, or did, at least in the soil and groundwater with respect to former refinery operations. Um, a lot of petroleum impact, a lot of heavy petroleum impact that we dealt with uh, in the soils. And then we actually have uh, impacts in the groundwater, primarily with PFAS, emerging contaminants. We started by uh, first looking at um, kind of the general technologies that have been evaluated and implemented for PFAS. And, and we knew activated carbon uh, was, was one of those technologies. Um, and you know, from there, it was a very simple uh, uh, thing for us to approach Regenesis and say, you know, we've used Plume Stop on other projects. It was very successful. Do you think it'll work here? And we worked extensively with Regenesis and their team to come up with um, an injection approach that we felt would best address the, the impacts. Plume Stop is a groundwater remediation technology designed to rapidly remove and permanently degrade groundwater contaminants, including PFAS. Plume Stop is composed of very fine particles of activated carbon suspended in water using organic polymer dispersion chemistry. Once in the subsurface, the material behaves as a colloidal biomatrix, binding to the aquifer matrix, rapidly removing contaminants from groundwater. On this site here, we had some geological challenges we have to face. We're dealing with some clay seams, as well as some uh, more permeable sand and gravel lenses, which is really what we're actually trying to target here. We're trying to make sure that the plume stop actually gets into that transmissive zone and can coat the entire soil matrix there so we can adequately stop the migration of this plume. For this site, plume stop was injected along an approximate 100 linear feet within a target zone of 13 to 17 feet below ground surface along the southeast property boundary to prevent PFAS migration off-site through groundwater. We're doing a six by six foot uh, spacing. It's essentially a permeable reactive barrier uh, with three rows within this uh, 100 foot long barrier and there's a six foot offset spacing. Using the drillers, we're drilling down to about 18 feet and to make sure we're covering that fully, we're starting with a two foot pull, injecting our 49 gallons per foot. So it ends up being 98 for the first pull and then completing the rest of our total prescribed volume, which is 244 gallons per point. Uh, we're covering that over the second interval with a three foot pull. We will continue to monitor uh, to assure that everything goes to plan. We've been working with Regenesis for many, many years, and we've always had excellent uh, a working relationship and, and very good success with all of your products. Uh, we really rely on the Regenesis team uh, to help guide us to make sure the, the outcome is successful. For more on Bloom Stop and effective approaches to eliminate PFAS risk, go to www.regenesis.com to learn more.